Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x power 4 minus 625 is equal to 0, to find the values of x from this equation. So, we make here in the left side in form of a perfect square. So, this x power 4 into square is x square, then bracket square, then minus 625 into square is 25 square, then is equal to 0. Now, from here, it is in the form of a perfect square. So, we'll apply a perfect square rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. So, when we compare a square with x square bracket square, then a is equal to x square. And when we compare b square with 25 square, then b is equal to 25 then in next step we'll apply this form which is a plus b it will be x square plus 25 so x square plus 25 then bracket bracket a minus b it will be x square minus 25 then bracket is equal to this zero then in next step from here we have two solutions whereas this is the first solution which is x square plus 25 is equal to 0 and the second solution is this x square minus 25 is equal to 0 now to solve from this first solution we take 25 into the right side so it will be x square is equal to negative 25 then we apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel with this square then it will be x is equal to plus or minus square root of negative 25 is same as 25 times negative 1 then it will be x is equal to plus or minus square root of 25 is 5 square root of negative 1 is i so it will be 5i so from here we have two solution two solutions because of plus or minus then to solve from here we will also apply a perfect square rule so it will be x square minus 25 is same as 5 square is equal to 0 so when we apply a perfect square rule which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket so when you compare a square with x square then a is equal to x and when you compare b square with 5 square then b is equal to 5 so when we apply this form it will be a plus b is x plus 5 then bracket bracket a minus b is x minus 5 then is equal to 0 then from here we have two cases this one and this one so this it will be x plus 5 is equal to 0 and this case is x minus 5 is equal to 0 so we take 5 into the right side then to be x is equal to negative 5 and here we take negative 5 to the right side to be x is equal to 5 then from here we have two solutions so, or we can solve in another way. From here, x minus 25 is equal to 0. X, I mean, x square minus 25 is equal to 0. We take 25 to the right side to be x square is equal to 25. Then, in here, we'll apply square root in both sides. So, this and this will cancel. Then, it will be x is equal to plus or minus square root of 25 is 5 so it is easy to use this perfect rule formula so as to not forget this minus 5 therefore from here we have two solutions so the first value of x is equal to when it is positive here it will be 5 and the second value of x is equal to when it is negative it will be negative 5 and the third value of x is equal to in this first solution when it's positive it will be 5i 
so 5i and the fourth value of x is equal to in here when it's negative to be negative 5i so negative 5i therefore these are all the values of x in this our problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye